If you listen to be lying in bed wide awake instead of fast asleep, you're not alone. But the good news is you can beat your insomnia without resorting to drugs or medication, which should always be a last resort in my view. You're by no means alone in not getting a good night's sleep though. And with all the pressures of our modern day lives, that's likely to stay the same unless you do something about it. <laughs> and that's why you're here. Medication has lots of problems and whilst natural remedies should have fewer if any side effects, it's still better to avoid taking them on anything other than a short term basis. Just in case, really. Good news is you can really beat insomnia without resorting to taking pills or potions. If your anxiety levels are high, that will almost certainly be affecting your sleep patterns. And practicing techniques like mindfulness can help reduce your anxiety levels. So to do this, you need to be more present and focus on the here and now rather than what happened in the past or what might happen in the future. And it may or may not, you don't know. And it's worth practicing mindfulness more often to help with this and your anxiety levels generally. Meditation can be another quick option and its effects are often quicker than the others because modern techniques mean you only need to listen to a specially designed audio to get the same benefits as you'd get from years and years of practice. And relaxing before you go to bed is another very good idea. Most of us expect to be able to slow down ready for sleep virtually at the click of our fingers or the push of a button and that just doesn't work, you know that. Personally, I start unwinding at least half an hour before I'm ready to go to bed, and I think you should do the same. And that means putting down your phone, stopping checking emails, and all the other must-do things that really don't need to be done. They can wait. Cut yourself off from the news as well, close to bedtime. It's avoid programs that involve too much thought. Otherwise your mind will still be looking at a serious documentary you keep meaning to watch and it will still be working out what it was looking at. And watch your caffeine and alcohol intake as well because both of those can affect how you sleep negatively. And consider playing yourself a purpose written hypnosis audio before you retire to bed. The pack of five audios I've linked to below this video cover different scenarios all to do, to do with sleeping well so you can choose the one that best fits your needs on any particular night. And they work well and they're all designed to help you get over your insomnia or your sleep problems. And to get a good night's sleep without any drugs or medication or anything unnatural. You could download them tonight and about half an hour's time be well on your way to beating your insomnia. Which sounds like a plan.